All right, time for a little update on the deer here. So it does not, it did not start from the key anymore. And uh, I got sick of this thing's problematic electrical system. And I've been slowly bypassing it. So this is our positive bus wire from a rewire I've done a while back. And this is now a wire that goes to one side of the relay on here, which is soldered on because, uh, you know, John Deere didn't use nuts and I didn't have a nut for it. Um, you don't need this side at all, so it's basically a three wire uh, with a fourth post that doesn't do anything. So that's nice to know. Um, and yeah, so we have our, our bus wire that goes here, which ties into a series of things here. It used to be a switch light it tied into. It ties into the horn. And uh, now it ties into this switch as well. And that feeds uh, the positive to the relay. And uh, I welded an extra support on here. So now this is real solid with the frame. Um, uh, yeah, it's real solid. It don't flex or anything. It's pretty solid. Pretty solid. And uh, I'm a little lightheaded from that. But yeah, so we turn our key in the on position. Hold down the pedal. Or I guess I don't have to. And we can... Uh, And that surging is uh, having that ethanol. So I probably got like a, I'm, pro I'm half normal gas, half uh, ethanol flex fuel crap. So that's why she's surging. She's, she's running lean, she don't like it. So yeah, there's my update in the John Deere. Back in service, ready to mow. Even though it's not warm enough for grass to grow.